Oh boy, you know what? We should probably come in on the. Nope, we got this. We got this, right? No, we do not have this. Uh, let's go ahead and throttle up. Abort landing. There we go. Ooh. <laughs> Hello YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Stormworks Build and Rescue, and yes folks, we are back once again, and today we are back with another Creations episode, and today I am extremely excited. Today we are going to be playing with an aircraft carrier, and it's one of those aircraft carriers that you have to spawn in with a mission. It does not spawn at the dock because it's huge. Now, the aircraft carrier itself looks like a pretty old carrier. It's actually got a plane on it that we should be able to launch. So we're going to start off by checking that out. Now it does sink, but today is not our sinking ship survival episode. I do a solo episode normally on Tuesdays, and then of course we do our little multiplayer thing on Fridays. But since it does have the button, you know we're going to have to click it. So all the creations that we'll feature today will be down in the description. We've got a couple other things to check out. If you guys have any suggestions for Stormworks, comment below. And if you're enjoying Stormworks on the channel, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. It helps out my channel. And let's check out this carrier. Oh man, I'm really excited. So this is the HMS Argus. Uh, this is by a creator that we've been checking out before. I believe it's GB Danny, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, like I said, it's down in the description. So where is this? Oh, oh yes. Oh, look at the laggy glory. That is amazing. So, supposedly this carrier is almost like a bit of a concept carrier. Uh, it does actually have the base of another ship on the bottom of it, but have you got the landing strip on top of it? And yeah, this thing looks pretty glorious and it's absolutely massive. Plus, I do see the plane right there too. So, let me get aboard and try to get it out a bit. That way it's not too laggy and we'll check it out. All right, so we are moving. So you can definitely see where this is. Uh, yeah, it's a landing strip basically on top of one of the other ships. So it's an experiment. And I hope that maybe this is something that's going to come up soon. Because could you imagine if we had like a, a true aircraft carrier that maybe housed uh, mo multiple ships in the bottom? So we do have a, a plane back there and you can see it right there. So there is an elevator that you can take this plane up to the actual uh, deck here, take off, and supposedly you can land on this. Obviously, that's a pretty decent sized runway. I do think that maybe, and I'm just going to say maybe I'll be able to hit that and actually uh, land this bad boy. Uh, but we're going to get out a little ways uh, and uh, probably get a little bit further away from the island. That way we can minimize the lag as much as possible, and then we'll get out and play with the plane. All right, we're going to go ahead and lose some speed. So we're not going to check out the bottom portion of this ship. I normally check out, like, everything, but since this is something else, which I think I've seen this ship on the workshop, we'll uh, check this whole normal ship out at some other point. But it is time to... What is that up there? Is that guns? Ooh. Uh, wait, are those guns? I think they are supposed to be guns. All right, so preparing for a little bit of a battle here, aren't we? Okay, so let's go ahead. Let's head over to the plane real quick. I need to read the instructions again. I think we need to call the elevator down, and then we'll be able to take off here. This is so exciting. Like, <laughs> I am really jazzed to be able to do this. Hold on, let's go under here. Uh, was that a switch? What, what switch was that? Okay, that's the deck locks. So you can see that the, uh, the plane's locked down right now. Uh, elevator is right here, so let's see. Elevator, elevator, elevator. Maybe we'll call it down from the top. Hold on, let's get up on the top real quick and check it out. Are we going to be able to hit this runway today? I have no clue. All right, let's turn that on. Oh, lift locks. Okay, so we have the locks right there. All right, this is epic. We're going to go down. We're going to get our airplane here, take off, uh, do some maneuvers, and attempt to land here. All right, so we're going to go ahead and undo the deck locks real quick. So the plane is technically... Wait a minute. Uh, seems like we're still... Are we moving still? Uh, no, we're not. I don't know. The plane was rolling back a bit. So I believe we have to fold up the wings on the plane. So let's go ahead and hop into it here. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and get out here. Arrest your gear. Throttle. Okay, wing fold. That's going to be six. 
There you go. You can see the wings are folding up there. Okay, so we're going to push this bad boy back. Uh, we can go ahead and hit the locks now. So we're going to hit those. You can see where there's other deck locks. So I'm assuming you would be able to have multiple planes. I don't know how you would get them by each other. I guess you'd have to take them off in order. But let's go ahead and start pushing this thing back. There we go. Uh, keep going. That works actually a lot better than I thought it would. Okay, so keep pushing, 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 pushing. Uh, almost there. Let's go ahead and hit lift locks are on. In just in case it rolls forward. All right, let's go ahead and take the elevator to the surface. Man, I feel like we should be playing some sort of epic military music right now as we go to the top. Oh, boy. <laughs> All right, we're going to go through our final preps here. Let's go ahead and make sure we have brakes engaged. Okay, brakes are on. Lift is down. Let's go ahead and fold the wings down real quick. There we go. Okay, so we're good to go there. All right, let's go ahead and fire it up here. Okay. All right, plane's fired. Let's go ahead. Should have the brakes on, so we should be able to unlock these real quick. So let's go. Lift locks are off. Oh, we're about to do it here. All right, so let's uh, climb back in. And let's go ahead and check our everything. Okay, that's working. Let's go check back here. Looking good. All right. All right. Well, I'm going to turn off the brakes, and we're going to throttle up. Actually, let's go ahead and throttle up now with the brakes on. Okay, start to... Let's go ahead and release brakes. Okay, throttle. All right, here we go. Oh, 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 come on. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, and then the music kicks in. That is awesome. That is so sweet. All right. Oh, let's go ahead and tilt it. Let's get a feel for this craft real quick. You know, I don't think I've ever uh, tried any of the crafts by the creator. This might be one of the first planes. I'm not really sure. Uh, this is, feels, uh, feels nice, though. It feels really good. All right, and there's our aircraft carrier. Oh, boy. That's the question is... Are we going to ever be able to land on that bad boy? I have no clue. Uh, it's going to take a bit of lining up. We tried to land on the Avengers carrier once. Uh, we never took off from it. We just attempted to land, I think, some sort of jet on it. Uh, I don't know if we're going to be doing that with this one here. All right, here we go, folks. We're going to go and go throttle back a bit. Okay. All right, waiting for our carrier to respawn here. Let's go 50% throttle. Actually, let's go about 40% throttle here. Where's our carrier at? It's loading, loading. There it is. So, yeah, you don't get much time because of the way the Stormworks loads in creations. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. You know what? We should probably come in on the... Nope, we got this. We got this, right? No, we do not have this. All right, let's go ahead and throttle up. Abort landing. There we go. Ooh. <laughs> All right. It said, uh, Stormworks always seems like it has, especially with planes, like a little bit of a delayed response. And that's one thing where it's like, you're trying to really line something up, and I should probably go at a much, like, probably further back angle and stuff like that. But since it despawns, it's hard to actually locate. Oh, well, that was embarrassing. Yeah, it's hard to locate where you're actually supposed to be. So let's go ahead and, oh, I'm going to need to really throttle it up here to get up out of the water. We now have a, uh, water plane. Oh, come on. Let me have a chance here, Stormworks. There we go. All right. We're going to throttle down. This is going to be the most crazy, stupid landing I think I've ever attempted. All right. Throttle's down. Oh, that is way too high. All right. Let's, uh, let's try this again. I'm really going to have to work on my piloting skills. <laughs> I'm not very good at landing aircrafts on uh, aircraft carriers. Oh, let's pop it up. Uh-oh. Come on. Come on. Okay. Decrease the throttle. Going for it. Going for the win here on... All right. This is... Yeah, this is bad. Note to yourself. Do not let Komodo fly any of your crafts. Not unless it's got GPS and autopilot on it. I think we might wind up kamikaze into the side of this thing. Uh, come on. Maybe that'll explain the sinking portion. Uh... Okay. Turn. Turn. I can't believe we're going to attempt it at this angle. All right. This is fine. Everything's cool. Ooh. <laughs> oh, no. No. Uh oh. Uh, uh, abandoned uh, plane. All right. Turn it off. I cannot get these things to uh, stabilize for me. 
Yeah, it's uh, it's a little bit of... I'm going to call it the delayed response. I'm pretty sure people were talented enough to actually land this stuff, but, you know, I don't think that's me. Hey, look, all the lifeboats deployed. Alrighty. I know everybody wants to see it, so we might as well go ahead and do it. Let's go to the wheelhouse here. Actually, the engine's off. Wow. Oh, let's relight the boilers. Actually, we're probably in deep enough water. Let's go lights. Unlock scuttle. Uh-oh, we're going to hit that. And what's that? Damage, fog. Oh, it's a rain station and wind speed. All right. There we go. So the damage is on. Let's go ahead and get up to the top deck and see what this looks like when it goes down. Oh, there's another plane on here. Hey, maybe we can do a plane escape here. I know I can take this thing off. You know, I just now noticed something. This uh, plane is actually under the elevator now. Can we push it forward? Oh, let's try pushing. Uh, is the brake engaged? Uh, I can't tell. Hold on. We still crank, don't we? Okay, brake is not engaged. Let's ease it forward just a little bit. Uh, I probably should put the wings up, shouldn't I? Let's go and fold those up. There we go. You know, just in case we have to... Oh, it would seem this boat is tipping forward, isn't it? Uh, that's not a good sign. Okay, let's go ahead and make this thing go forward here. What's wrong with it? Oh, it's stuck in the, uh... Oh, that's a bit of a situation, isn't it? All right, so... Come on. Um, uh... I guess we gotta throttle up pretty hard here. Oh, no, no, no! Why would the back end come up? Okay, come on, roll over! Oh, we just did a stoppy in a plane! No, 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 no! Stop, 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 stop! Brakes, 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 brakes! Okay, brakes are on. Folks, I think we have an emergency here. It would indeed seem like the ship is tipping forward, so, alright, let's, uh, wait, the brakes are, wait, would this thing roll forward then? Oh, it is rolling forward, okay. Uh, we need to call the elevator. Is there an elevator button here at the bottom? There should be, shouldn't there? Uh, alright, uh, oh, there it is. Okay, call elevator. Come on, elevator. Uh, oh, no, 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 the elevator. Uh-oh, uh, okay, so we have half of a, uh, oh, that means we have half of a runway to take off from. Uh, time is of the essence here, folks. The front half of the aircraft carrier is gone. What are we stuck on? We're stuck. We're, we're stuck on something. How come this worked before? Uh, we don't think we can launch the plane from here. Are we still going down? Uh, wait, are we at the bottom? Hold on. How did the front disappear and we're at the bottom over here? No, we're not at the bottom. No, it's still shifting. Okay, come on, plane. Uh, uh. Come on, get up on the elevator. It won't go on the elevator now. Oh, well, it doesn't go up when you have the brakes on, dum dum. All right, brakes are off. Okay, so we should be good to go. Wow, we just wasted a good, like, minute there. Right, push it back. All right. There we go. No, it's nudging. Come on, I need you to work with me, plane. Uh, get up on the elevator. Come on. There we go. Okay. We need to get moving. This thing is still, I believe, going down. So, elevator. Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. I hope that back section doesn't get caught. Oh, boy. Hold on. Can we get the locks? Maybe to pick it up? Uh, let's push it forward a bit. There it goes. All right, it's on the locks. All right, let's go and get it cranked. We are in a sinking ship trying to escape via airplane. This is crazy. Where did the front half of the boat even go? And how is the back half still up? I don't understand. All right. Let's go ahead. Turn those lift locks off. All right. Top up in the plane. Uh, let's go ahead and put these down. Okay. All right. Here we... Oh. Okay. I thought it was going to break. All right. Here we go. All right. Let's get the heck off of here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Come on. Come on. No. 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 <laughs> no. I couldn't get the throttle up all the way. Uh, well, that was a major fail. Uh, let's top that. You know what? I'm fine. That's cool creation. We'll just leave it at that. I, I'm just not very good at airplanes. Oh, boy. That was pretty awesome still. All right, so for our next little creation here, we have a, uh, it's going to be another spawn mission. Now, check this out. We have a boat ramp. Now, we're going to do this, and we actually have a boat and trailer. It's uh, pretty cool looking. Let's see if, okay, did that spawn already? 
Uh, where is our boat ramp at? You know, I've always said it. This uh, island needs a boat ramp, period. Like, I don't know why it doesn't have one. It would seem like that would be uh, perfect for it. But question is, where did our our boat ramp spawn? Oh, did it not spawn? No, it, it definitely spawned. Hold on, let's go load. Oh, no, it's down over here, isn't it? Oh. Okay, let's see. Oh, there it is. Well, actually, that's... Yeah, it's just a really... I think a line of blocks that's on, like, a, a hinge or something going down. But, yeah, I've seen some uh, some people have been creating, like, ferry docks and stuff like that. So, there's the boat ramp. Let me go get the uh, the car and boat, and we'll see if we can actually load it uh, into the water here. All right, so we have the USCG 250. This is the Defender with the truck and trailer. And this is, I'm assuming, made for the boat ramp over there. So, oh, uh, that's cool. It is kind of weird seeing how many uh, vehicles get made for this game, even though there's not really many areas to drive around with. And I'll, hopefully that changes. I've always said it'd be cool if they would spawn in like a shoreline or something that maybe had like a town and a Coast Guard station on it. That way you can give vehicles a little bit more use instead of them being on these small islands. This is cool. I got a sidestep there. So this is like a little Coast Guard ship. Uh, okay, let's go ahead. Let's get into here and let's just hop into the seat from here. Oh, is that a window? How do we get these? How do we get this open? Do I actually have to pull these open? Great. Komodo can't even figure out the door. There we go. Alright, let's get into the truck here. You gotta play the epic music while you're in the truck. Let's go and lights, winch magnets. Okay, we don't need those. Let's crank it up. Let's get the lights on. Brakes are off. Alright. You know, I'm pretty sure I could tip this over. Look at that. Look at the suspension on that truck, actually. That's cool looking. Uh oh. Uh oh. Look at that. Three wheel in it. Look like a dirt. Oh no! I was gonna say, we look like a dirt oval car. Uh, oh. No, no, no. Are you kidding me? Um, yep. That just happened. I can't manage to get myself back over, can I? Hon. Hon. Come on. Come on. Well, we're taking this one back to the workbench. All right, take two. It looks like there's actual buttons on, like, the tailgate and even the little toolbox in the back. That's pretty cool. All right, let's try not to flip it this time. So... We're going to come up over here. Let's go ahead and turn, and I am really, really bad at backing up a trailer, so this is probably going to be pretty painful to watch. See if we can uh, see if we can get this. Okay, here we go. Let's get the wheel straight. Okay. We are not even close to being lined up. All right, we look to be a little bit more in line here, so I hate backing trailers up. It's like the worst thing ever. Like... You know, you almost just want to drive the car and the trailer into the uh, into the ocean here. All right, this might be a bit painful. It's okay. I'm doing it. I'm backing this trailer up. All right, keep going. Uh, let's try not to get the truck in there. I want to try to actually properly unload this. Uh, here we go. Okay, so we're at the ramp portion now. So, it's just going to roll a little bit easier here, and it really falls off. Where's the actual... Okay, there's the ending of the ramp. It looks like it was just like a complete drop-off, but no, that's the water uh, touching the end of the ramp there. So, we want to lower... Make sure... We... Okay, yeah, we do have brakes on this. We're going to need to apply the brakes. Keep going. You know, I'm pretty sure about right there the boat should be able to get off. So, let's go ahead and apply the brakes. Okay, brakes are on. All right, sweet. Let's go unload us a boat here. There we go. So how does this thing work? What are we dealing with? This looks like we got... That's the boat lock, trailer brakes. Oh, those were on? Uh, okay, dolly. Let's go ahead. Prop that down. See, there's the winch. Let's go ahead. I guess really just unlocking the boat's going to be fine here. So let's unlock the boat. And we should be able to lower the back uh, motors up and just kind of pull the boat back off. Yeah, I'm floating right here, so uh, let's get up in here. This is uh, this is really cool. Uh, I've always wanted to kind of properly do this on the game, and I haven't been able to. And why does the door not work? Uh-oh. No, the door's jammed. Can I can I reach in? Is there? Is that all windows? No, you're kidding me. Why would the door be jammed? No. <laughs> No, is there an alternate way? Is there like a roof hatch or something up there? Oh, I want in the boat. Oh, this just isn't my day. Front hatch, where's that? Oh, yes! Front hatch, woo! 
Uh, oh, and I can fit into this. Oh, yay. Thankfully, there was a front hatch. Okay, so flashers. Uh, how do we close this? Do I need to actually... Uh, okay, oh, the button's right here. Here we go. Oh, ready? Three, two, one. Front hatch. All right, so let's see what we got here. Let's go ahead and turn. Uh, we don't need spotlights. Work lights are on. There's the front hatch button. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and turn stabilizer engine on. Side doors. Okay, this is where we need to be. Okay, engines are on. Uh, a bunch of levers. Left throttle, engine trim. Okay, so we need to uh, we just slowly back up off. Of the oh, actually, the engines are not in the water. Oh, okay, hold on. Let's... <laughs> Put those down real quick. Alright, let's lower those. There we go. Alright, so engines are down. Should be able to back up here. There we go. Uh, we're a little stuck on the side. Uh oh. Uh oh, come on. Eh, squeeze your big butt off of this trailer. Oh, uh oh. Oh, how have I done this? Is it the stabilization that's doing it? Hold on, let's go throttle sink. Okay, keep throttle sync on. Let's turn that off real quick. Uh, come on. No! Why am I stuck on this trailer? Oh, there's a winch that's still... <laughs> I've got it wide open right now. I am a failure at everything, I believe. Alright, what the heck's going on here? Oh, is the lock button right here? Okay, that's fine. Alright, let's get the lock winch magnet off. There we go. Alright, let's get the... Uh... Well, you know what? I'm good. I've had enough. Uh, say goodbye to the boat. It's going to go hit those rocks over there. Uh, we're just going to pull forward. I didn't... I thought... Uh, okay, so apparently those are stuck. Wow. Can't believe we just... We just pulled our boat away without us being in it. Well, I mean, it was a pretty cool looking boat. Looked like a pretty standard... Coast Guard rescue boat, but you know, I'm done. I'm done. I'm completely done. This is why Komodo can't have nice things. So done right now. So completely entirely done. There we go. Alright. Let's move on to the next thing. You know, there's days like today where nothing has gone right for me, where you just kind of just want to get away and just get on a yacht Get away from the main island and just forget about all your troubles and everything that you've gone through today. So we've checked out some really cool creations, uh, mainly focused on the aircraft carrier and the potential uh, what's going to happen there. Uh, but the last thing I have here, I just thought, you know, it would just be nice just to check out something nice in the game like a yacht. So no tricks to this. It is simply a yacht. It does have some really nice underglow, which we're going to go ahead and we're going to party at night here. Check that out. That is cool looking. Oh boy. So yeah, we can just get up here on the ultra nice yacht. Got the nice uh, backlit green there. Pretty cool. Make sure we have all the deck lights on. That's actually a really cool effect with the, uh, the glow there. Huh. That is really cool. Okay. So let's check out this luxurious yacht. You know, that's always been kind of a dream. I've always wanted to be on a yacht, just to try it out. I never want to own one because it's just way too expensive, but still. I think it'd be cool. And, oh, man, check out the bar lights here. This thing's ready for a party. You got fridge doors down here. A full bar. That is awesome. You got the tables up here. Uh, we got our anchors up here at the front. That is cool. Man, I love the way this thing looks, the way it's lit up. Alright, so say you're not one to partake in the party on the deck, you can always come to the party inside. Looks like we got like a little kitchen area over here. Uh, microwave, which that's like ultra settings, like let that stare into your face for a little bit. Whew, it's a little hot. Even the oven door opens up. It's even details like that, just make a build. Alright, so you can come back here, this is the, uh, looks like the home movie theater or something, like the little living area. Is that a TV? There we go, we're watching uh, Discovery, I think. I uh, got that, you got nice little windows. What's anything? Oh, what's this back here? Does this uh, take us to, oh, this is the engine room, okay. Sweet, so you got the engine room, you got lights back here. Okay, you don't actually have to start it up back here, you can start it up at the top. 
So we got that. So you got this nice living area. What's this? Bathroom. Okay, it's pretty standard. And over here, it looks like we have a server room. Is that a normal thing on a, uh, on a yacht? I think it's maybe just where he's keeping his logic. All right, we hop up through here. Let's go up to the front. Oh, your PC ran into a problem. So apparently we're running some version of Windows up here on this main screen. So you got that over here. Looks like we have bedrooms to the sides here. Yep, there's a bedroom right there. Another TV. Jurassic Park. Huh. Oh, and these have their own little personal... Oh, those are actually really nice. These own little personal bathrooms here, too. Sweet. So, same... Yeah, same setup on this side. Uh, I need to close some doors here. Now, this does not have a sinking feature, for anybody wondering. Uh, it's just simply here for a little leisurely uh, getaway. But, to end the episode, we sure can put it through its paces in a storm. Uh, let's go up here. There we go. Nice looking. Would be a shame if, uh, you know, the old weather would kick up here and go up and up. There we go. Yes. You know, I actually do think this yacht's going to do just fine here. So we're just going to let it cruise out here. And we're just going to ride up here in the top. Beautiful. Love me some nighttime waves. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, that is cool. You know, I'm not sure a yacht is made for waves like this. Probably should have looked at the forecast ahead of time. There we go. We'll just power through them. It's a really nice looking yacht, though. You don't see... You see quite a few of these, but it's definitely not the most popular item on the workshop, and I think we've only used them a couple times. Uh, I did a sinking ship survival with one, and then uh, I think we've used maybe one in a multiplayer episode where we did like a spoof of uh, Team 10. But it's always nice to go back and just kind of appreciate these things. Ah, such a nice, beautiful evening. But anyways, I think it's going to wrap it up for this episode of Stormworks. I'll have the uh, creations link down in the description. So if you want to play with anything from the creations episode here today, uh, they'll be down there. Sinking Ship Survival should be coming up soon. And then, of course, we'll have our multiplayer coming up also. So if you guys have any ideas for that, comment below. But yeah, thank you guys for watching this episode of Stormworks. And we will see you guys next time.